Hi, and welcome to our channel. Um, today we're doing a quick review of the uh, of the dam site park. This is a uh, COE park or U.S. Army Corps of Engineers park. It is located on the uh, Greer's Ferry Lake. Um, this is a uh, it's a large park. They have 242 available sites. And the sites are located in loops, uh, lettered K, S, J, I, N, M, H. We're, uh, we're in H2 right here. Um, L, G, F. And then this is the, the swimming area over here. And then these are, um, they have an area for group camping. And then smaller primitive sites. They have some that are that are right down near the water. Um, you can't drive to them, but you can park and then walk or you know, walk in and set up camp uh, right next to the uh, to the lake if you wish. Um, this some sites um, you'll if you pause the video you'll be able to see these these sites have water hookup. They also have electric. Uh, these sites have electric. Um, 20 and 30 amp and then these have 20 30 and 50 amp in the in in these areas here now if you have a larger rig um, you're going to want to stay in either the n or the m um, loop the n loop has a few um, five or six uh, pull through sites but all of these sites are large enough for the bigger rigs the fifth wheels the class a's the super c's um, there would be the, the way to go. There are some sites within these areas um, that you can get a bigger rig in uh, with a little finagling, uh, but you, you can get them in. And in just a second, I'll show you what we, uh, what we ended up with. Um, <clears throat> as you can see, they've got, uh, they've got a trail uh, that you can, you can walk different trails. Uh, they do have uh, restrooms and shower facilities here. Uh, there again, you can see the amenities um, that they have listed. If you want to make reservations, uh, I know the, the, the numbers right there, but they're going to tell you to go to recreation.gov to make re uh, uh, reservations. Most of the sites are, uh, are on reservation only. Um, I saw a very few that looked like they might be a first come first serve, but the vast majority of them are going to be uh, reservations required to uh, to get in. The rates, um, I forget what the, the they vary. If, uh, I, I think it's from from twelve dollars to twenty four dollars a night, something like that. But if you have a um, a America the Beautiful uh, interagency card your rates will be half price. Uh, we, uh, we booked two nights here and, and, it, and it, the total came to $18 because of our, uh, our recreation card that, the, that we have there, that pass card, if you will. Now let me show you where we're at. This is the, uh, the main road out here is what comes into the, into the campground and goes to the different loops. Like I said, we're in loop H and it's a little tough to see, but right through the trees, right in there, that's a restroom area. And then that building over there is a, uh, a shower house. And they have eight shower uh, rooms over there, uh, hot water showers, um, parking lot outside of the, the uh, shower house, as well as the restroom. Now, all of the, sorry about that, all of the sites have painted on the, uh, uh, on the uh, uh, approach to the site, the site number. So they're real easy to, real easy to find. Now we made our reservations, like I said, online at night. Um, for whatever reasons, the, the photos were not working and we weren't really able to see what kind of a site we were getting. I just knew by my filters that I wanted a site that was at least 50 feet deep. Well, they didn't tell, it didn't say anything about trees being right next to the road. We've got this tree right here, as you can see, which is uh, next to the rig. And over here, we have this tree right here. 
Now, at night, in, in the dark, his little, uh, it was a little tricky getting in, but we did get it in. But as you can see, we're, there's not a whole lot of people here right now. When, uh, when we pulled in Saturday, there was a group over there. They left Sunday morning, and it's been pretty much this. Um, this is Monday morning. Um, we will be pulling out ourselves. I don't know if you can see it, but there's some folks down there. Um, down the road, the road here goes down and around and over that way, and there's some areas that are right down on the water that you can uh, uh, you can camp next to. Nice sites. Uh, some of the sites in these in the in the loops, other than the, the ones that I said for the larger rigs, um, we we went looking. We found that yeah, you'd be able to get a larger rig in. Um, little finagling. I mean, I was able to get ours in uh, in this site here. Um, just took a little. Uh, like I said, a little finagling to get it in, but uh, uh, we, we were able to get it in. Um, again, this is a nice site, a nice campground. Um, the restroom areas, the, the showers, uh, they could use a little bit more attention, but hey, it's, it's uh, um, what they classify as a, a holiday weekend because of Columbus Day um, today. Uh, so... Um, you know, you know, government. <laughs> Anytime they can get off, they take it. So, um, I don't know if you can see. Yeah, right. Gotta get my finger right there. There we go. Right there. That. Let's see if I can do this without missing. That's water. Pressurized water. You hook up, uh, you hook up to a hose bib, turn, uh, um, uh, turn the water on if, to, to get water uh, for this particular uh, for this particular loop. So again, um, this this campground is located in uh, Hebert Springs, Arkansas. Thanks again for uh, for stopping by. Oh, let me show you one other thing. They, they don't. Unfortunately, they don't seem to uh, seem to use them. Um, maybe they do during the, during the peak seasons or, or busy times. I'm not sure. Speaking of seasons, uh, this park does close um, October 30th, so it's not a year-round park. But they do have these signs at the beginning of each of the loops. And I think they're, normally they would probably write on there in grease pencil, you know, what sites were available. But I think this was probably something they, they um, again, like I said, do during, the, during the, the, the busy season. I'm not sure. Um, with it being reservable, uh, I'm not sure how functional this board is anymore. But anyway, uh, as you can see, right, well, maybe you can't see. But let's zoom. Try to do this. Ooh, that doesn't work too well. There's a fifth wheel right there, and he's uh, he's in he's in this same loop with us, the the H loop. So you can uh, you can get uh, get rigs in some of the other uh, some of these uh, smaller areas. With that, uh, again, thank you for stopping by. Uh, please subscribe doesn't cost anything and like i said i'm not i'm not going to send you a bunch of junk on the other side real quick on the other side of the road there there's more campsites over there those are the primitive some of the primitive sites they have no electricity over there and they do have some sites that are primitive with electricity so hey again you have a large selection to choose from um we'll we'll uh on our way through Arkansas, we'll probably stop here again. This is a nice park. Have a great day. Bye.